Hey guys, it's uh, Corona Marsa Day uh, 5, uh, 12, uh, Phase 3, uh, Day 20. Uh, Two. Oh, the video uh, went yesterday uh, due to schedule conflict. Uh, that was my birthday, so. Eh. Well, anyway, that we're back to like uh, the three hundreds, uh, close to the four hundred, with the three hundred seventy-eight uh, coronavirus cases uh, today. Uh, So apparently we're going back up again. <laughs> so, 94 cases are from Toronto, so Toronto is still in the lead, mm -hmm, no question. 62 is from uh, York region, 38 from Peel region, 30 from H Hamilton, 20 from Durham region, and And also from Waterloo region, and 19 is from Windsor Essex region. So, Windsor Essex region is on uh, this again. Uh, hmm. Like uh, London Middlesex region uh, is in, uh, on the list uh, for uh, a high, of high cases for a couple of times, actually, uh, for the last uh, couple of days and weeks. So, all other uh, regions are reported under 10. Nine deaths not reported. Okay. Variants. Okay. Uh, UK variants are fourth one hundred forty-five thousand five hundred sixty-four, which is uh. uh Which is a boost uh, uh, of a uh, uh, plus five. You, South African variant is, is that four thousand one thousand four hundred ninety. Oh, okay. It has not changed uh, since uh, August August first. So this is a. Uh, so this has actually been uh, about six. Like, the seventh day uh, since this is happening, and uh, I don't know why, and yeah. The Brazilian variants, uh, 5,174, that's, uh, yeah. Which apparently, apparently at the plus four uh, since the previous day, and uh, yeah, it's uh, and uh, since uh, August fifth, uh, uh, it's uh, it's been a uh, ten and uh, actually a uh, ten ten uh, difference, uh, and uh, in the in the variant uh, is at uh, five thousand one hundred eighty two, uh, so. Uh, which means the India, vari India variant has be officially beaten both the South African variant and the Brazilian variant. So this means uh, the India variant is that the second most uh, dangerous uh, variant uh, that we need to watch out for. And uh, so, yeah, I'm not joking about it. I'm not joking about it. Because it is just uh, beating it by eight cases. 
difference. So yeah. So we are officially in trouble. So you know, I got the vaccine of uh, that uh, detail uh, down below, and uh, and also uh, phase three and phase four. Mm -hmm. And uh, today's uh, topic that I thought I want to focus on, uh, uh, and apparently since uh, we can't really go on uh, phase uh, phase four yet, because of course, uh, uh, looking at Ottawa, yeah, they're still stuck in phase. Three. They still haven't met the requirements to move on to phase four. So yeah, well, that there's that. Even though it's uh, been, uh, you know, it's the twenty second day actually, so. Uh, we should have been actually been allowed, but apparently uh, we'll have to see. So today, today's topic has to do with travel. So apparently, uh, this uh, travel has had to do with travel and. Uh, Mixed uh, coronavirus uh, vaccine, uh, so uh, so Canada's health authority has given the green light to mix and match uh, COVID nineteen vaccines, but as the world reopens, not all are recognized as a mix of uh, vaccines from different makers as f fully vaccinated. Despite millions of uh, Canadians are uh, afford like uh, doing a mix and match vaccine uh, so uh, so I'm just I'm just gonna make, make a list of uh, places where uh, they uh, don't uh, accept uh, mix and match vaccine so I'm talking about like uh, if you got Pfizer BioNTech and then you got Moderna or uh, or Moderna to first Pfizer or or any other any other basically three Vaccines that are available right now. So, if you think so, number one, cruises. The C, the Center for Disease Control, uh, the U.S. Uh, you say the main health body that does not currently recognize a mix of a uh, vector vaccine such as AstraZeneca, which uh mRNA vaccines such as Pfizer BioNTech or Moderna as fully vaccinated. They don't accept that apparently. So yeah. It does however rec rec recognize a mix of two mRNA vaccines that So if you mixed up two mRNA vaccines together, so if you got one and then you got another mRNA vaccine, that's fine. But if you got the uh, mRNA vaccine, uh, let's say you got the AstraZeneca first, and then you switch to mRNA, they won't let you. Sorry, you'll have to wait. So, so many cruise lines are following the CA. CDC the guidance uh, in their own protocols for for who can come aboard uh, so such as princess cruises uh, celebrity cruises carnival cruise line and Holland America so they said they uh, will not recommend recognize uh, those who have been mixed on AstraZeneca vaccine with the mRNA vaccine as fully vaccinated So, uh, celebrity uh, cruise, uh, cruises that uh, they will consider guests uh, fully vaccinated with uh, proofs of a vaccination that include uh, mixed doses of the Pfizer and uh, Moderna mRNA vaccines only. Though no other uh, mixed vaccines uh, doses uh, will qualify as uh, guests that's fully vaccinated. 
according to the, their website. So Carnival's policy applies from cru cruises are leaving from U.S. Uh, ports. Uh, the Norwegian cruise line is going going further and not accepting any mix of vaccines, including two mRNA vaccines, which so they're not going to mixing any mix of vaccines when departing from the U.S. ports, but will accept a mix of only. AstraZeneca SK Bio, Professor BioNTech, or Moderna combinations uh, from non US ports. Uh, so, not from USA, but from other, yeah. So, Royal Caribbean uh, is a uh, not be a, a set uh, mixed doses when departing from uh, any uh, from a U.S. port, uh, but, will, but from a non-U.S. port, uh, depending on a specific country's uh, policy, and already car, car Canadians have been caught trying to break these rules. Uh, uh, travel bloggers uh, Karen and uh, Brian. Ozier of uh, Port Coquitlam, uh, British Columbia, have uh, six uh, cruises uh, booked over the next year, but both were first vaccination, vaccinated with the uh, AstraZeneca vaccine, and then uh, they got the Pfizer BioNTech mRNA uh, vaccine. Uh, so, and uh, there's questioning whether should uh, they should cancel their trip or something. And uh, so, uh, did an infection disease uh, epido epidemiologist at the University of uh, Waterloo, uh, Zahid, uh, that has a uh, he has uh, said there's a not there's no uh, scientific uh, evidence uh, that is uh, there's a uh, So it's uh, there's not there won't be no problems and uh, and uh, he also said there is no scientific evidence to to say people who have a second dose which is of a different vaccine would have a lesser immunity than uh, the ones who have the same uh, vaccine. Uh, and he and of course he said uh, there has to be a. Uh, scientific evidence to justify why you are not allow, allowing people to join cruises. Uh, no, yeah. So, uh, of course, con number two, countries. Addition, uh, so some countries have their own policies uh, through uh, mixed uh, vac vaccinations, as well as the uh, COVID shield uh, vaccine, the Indian made uh, version of AstraZeneca. So, uh, So the country of uh, Trinidad and Tobago does not currently accept travelers with a mix of a Moderna. So they don't allow a mix of mRNA vaccine, but they allow a so mixed vaccine of uh, AstraZeneca or and uh, one uh, mRNA vaccine. Hmm. There's that. Barbados reversed its uh, policy on uh, Jul July 15th to allow mixed vaccines after initially not accepting. So they're, they're, uh, they they said yes. Jamaica will, will not accept anyone with two doses of a WHO approved uh, vaccine, mixed or not. And uh, however, they will accept. And uh, so Cuba and uh, 
and the Dominican Republic, uh, they have uh, they have no problems though. Although the USA, uh, when uh, and Canadians enter uh, uh, into USA, uh, though there's no problem with that, but uh, they are uh, currently, uh, they have uh, not approved the uh, AstraZeneca vaccine. Uh. And then there was a the, the pro recent problem with the uh, Lady Gaga and the Tony Bennett con concert is uh, happening, uh, and uh, and the requirement uh, in New York, New York State's uh, guidelines that apparently you know, you must be fully vaccinated, and uh, that means you must uh, not uh, mix and match, uh, no mix and match of uh, AstraZeneca with the uh, vaccine and with the mRNA vaccine, so. So, you're focusing on Europe, uh, so, uh, like Spain and Greece, Iceland and France, uh, they do accept the vaccine. So, and Germany and France only accept the combination of AstraZeneca and Pfizer, BioNTech, or Moderna as uh, fully vaccinated and not to... Uh, to mRNA vaccine, so you have to it has to be two at the mix of uh, mRNA and AstraZeneca. But of course, uh, they have to prevent uh, you know the coronavirus uh, negative uh, negative coronavirus uh, test to enter because of course they're playing safe. So uh, the pr province of uh, Quebec in Canada uh, will uh, now allow its re residents to get a third shot of an mRNA coronavirus vaccine to avoid policies against the mixing vaccine and uh, COVID shield vaccine uh, that that India made. So, uh, <laughs> although uh, they have been uh, warned uh, to seek advice and. Uh, Weigh the risk before getting a ex the third shot. Oh, it's pretty risky. I'll, 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 I'll say. Because uh, if you're traveling, uh, you better like uh, know like uh, the requirements, and uh, you better look it up. Hospitalization, uh, 138 people are hospitalized with coronavirus, uh, plus 24, and uh, 11, 111 uh, ICU patients, plus 1, and uh, 82 ICU patients uh, using a ventilator, plus 2. There have been uh, no uh, long-term care home uh, death uh, updates. Uh. So I'll just uh, show you on uh, the 5th, uh, August 5th. So please uh, follow coronavirus safety rules and regulations and phase 3 rules uh, and, uh, and of course uh, phase 4 rules when they have start. Uh, I'll uh, try to uh, I'll announce it. Don't have uh, gatherings over 25 for the safety of others. Uh, stay safe. Sign up for vaccinations. Uh, if you're traveling, please uh, make sure like uh, whether you can mix vaccinations or uh, not mix vaccinations. Uh, 
And of course, uh, make sure that which vaccinations you're getting, uh, like the COVID shield uh, vaccination uh, that India is, uh, apparently made. Inf information down below. Stay safe.